Just like a pallet, we laying shit down. My man bitch and then I shocked the whole town. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let, 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 let's start here. Ah, bug up. 2K ass. It hit different when I spend money on 2K and I don't want to play it. It hit different when I'm about to get back on 2K22. It hit different. 24 might be ruined. Zens are back. Ghost contests are back. There's a dribbling delay in the park. We have the shooting slump of doom. Badge regression. Guards can't even dribble without getting ripped. This game needs to be fixed. This is my first reaction to Hank the Tank. Hank the Tank is one of the most legendary 2K niggas out here, man. Just because. Niggas know. Thanks, bro. Yo, YouTube. What is up with all of you beautiful human beings today, man? So, and I'm a big. It's the worst year. It's worse than 23. 2K24 has been out for over a week now, and we are already two. I'm trying to force myself to like the game. Comment if you forcing yourself to like the game. I need y'all to drop comments right now, quicker now. Um, he patches deep he into the game now. Now there is a good amount of good things about 2K24. This game is not bad at all, but there is a lot of horrible things about this game that just need fixed or that was fine. And 2K made worse with this new patch. 2K, we have a lot of fixing to do. Allow me to put this in a very nice manner. This game is not fun for guards one bit. If you play this game at a competitive level, this game is not fun for guards. This game is only fun for lockdowns and maybe centers as well. I have fun playing on my center. Now you guys know me, I'm Hanky the Dribble God. This is the first year I can tell you I enjoy playing on my center more than my guard. And why is that? If you play this game at a casual level, say I'm playing Park 2s, I'm fine. I am completely fine. I'm not getting ripped constantly, but if you play Pro-Am, if you play Stage, if you play against a lock with thumbs that work, you are going to be in hell. So there is a lot, a lot of things wrong with 2K24, and I am going to go over absolutely every single thing that needs to be fixed, that needs to be addressed for this game to be better now for the casuals watching this video who are like oh you suck you can't adapt blah, 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 blah. you can't adapt to the game you just suck why are you complaining stop crying oh god crying. i got a 92 win percentage i've been the best in almost every single 2k we have a 250k my team back to back champion complaining about the same exact stuff every top professional pro and player is complaining and every single comp stage player is complaining so first off we have a horrible dribbling delay in 2k24 so in previous 2ks yeah of course the game's on console there's gonna be a tiny bit of input delay but if you go watch any of my old dribble tutorials or anyone else's old dribble tutorials if you look at the controller on the screen compared to the gameplay the movement comes almost instantaneously now look on 24 i held square and it took very long and slow motion for my character to start shooting the ball now look at the dribbling I bro okay i'm deleting 2k20 man i just right I want my money back. I want my money back. Flip down on the right stick. It should happen almost instantaneously. My player should have done the move almost instantly. Now I'm sitting in the Gatorade facility. I'm not dribbling. I'm not shooting. The controller moves my player almost instantaneously. The camera moves instantly. Now when I'm on the court though, look at the controller, then look at my player. I flick down and it takes so long for my player to complete the dribble move. Now, this is not just in the Gatorade facility. This is in the park as well. Every player who plays this game competitively has noticed this. This game, it feels like it's honestly on West servers if I live in the East Coast. This delay, it's pretty bad, man. There has never been a worse dribbling delay in any 2K. So when I flick the right stick a certain way, it takes a long time for the input to register. 2K needs to fix this, man. We cannot be having this. Like, you can still dribble in this game, of course, but you just need to do it at a slower rate now. Like, you have to literally let the animation fully play out before you can do something else afterwards. 2K desperately needs to fix this, man. And I even DM'd LD2K and the devs about it, and they said they do believe it is because of the cross-play 
but like this delay, it's just something else. Man, I'm on current gen. I don't think it's cause playing on current gen. It hit different when current gen doing the same thing. Ah, oh, bug up. Close, man. Like dribblers are already so handicapped compared to these lockdowns. And they thought I was about to put some spend money on a P5 just to play these bad games. It hit different. It hit different when y'all ain't get my money. Get every single. It hit different when y'all just got a little of my money. It hit different. These ain't butter bugs. These shirt sure cap bugs. It hit different. Steel. So fans to one of the best, if not the best, stage guard in the game said, I'm going to be honest, plucks are in a terrible state, and that is not debatable. I cannot play stage without getting plucked three times at least regardless of whether the lockdown is good or not. Now, if you guys don't know who Splash is, he won the 250k My Team Tournament back-to-back -back in 2K22 and in 2K23. Now, this is Splash right here. He is playing Pro-Am, and the lock reaches once, and it throws him from the hash all the way back court, and it's a backcourt violation. All the lock had to do was just press their square button once. One press of the thumb. Now, this is the comp stage. As you can see, this guard, he just gets the ball. He tries to do one dribble move. He can't even move. He is literally in shackles. He cannot move. You literally cannot move in the stage. You cannot move in the... Why would he... Why would you even say this game is halfway good, bro? This shit is obviously horrible as fuck. Pro-Am. They made... Long little Kobe, y'all disrespectful. Y'all need to go back to 2K22 build setups 2k21 build setups why did y'all go to this new shit bro y'all gonna make me stop playing 2k everybody know i'm the number one come on bro i'm glad i'm on youtube now because it's like i used to be on the game lockdowns too <laughs> overpowered it's not just me complaining about it ask any competitive player in the stage in the 2k the reason why i'm on youtube i was fine by just you know working doing regular life shit and playing the game Shit, y'all got my ass on YouTube reacting to this bullshit. Pro am if you're just playing park, it is fine. I noticed in park, I'm completely fine. I set foot in the pro am Look, I do two dribble moves and I'm getting harassed. I'm this lockdown just has to press the square button once. Look, I do two, three dribble moves. I'm running up the court. The lock bumps me once. Once he bumps me once, all he has to do is just press square one time. The ball is his. Look, I just gotta do the same thing. He gets the ball. Tap my square button once. I only have silver glove. I get it instantly guaranteed. But oh wait, oh wait, look. <laughs> I do one dribble move. All he has to do is press square once and the ball is his. All I have to do is just dribble one. Look, two moves. He, he just gets a pluck steal. Wait, hold on. Hanky Cook? Hanky Cook? I can't shoot. Look, guys, now I'm in, the, I'm in the shooting slump of doom. We gotta do something about the shooting slump as well, guys. Like, these steals are just so bad for lockdowns, bro. Like, it's so easy. Look at this screenshot, guys. Like, the guard on the other team. Like, this is a competitive team. He's 1 for 7. I'm 0 for 6. I got plucked 4 times. Look, if you run into any good team. Look, both of both of the team's records are good, man. I get the ball. 1, 2. Instantly, he just plucks me. What can I do? What can I do? I just get up the court. I can't even move. He, he gets another pluck. Like, what can we do? This is how the scores look in competitive Pro-Am. As you can see, the guards on the winning team shot 3 for 11. Once again, the guard on the winning team, 3 of 11 from 3. And I'll be shooting worse than that. And that's competitive guards shooting 5 for 13. Oh, my God. That's a good game for me. If I shoot 5 for 13, I'm hyping, jumping around on 24. I'm deleting it right now. I'm deleting it right now. Three. Once again, the guard on the winning team. Four of 15. Three of 13 from three. And then the guard on the winning team once again. Four of 15 with four turnovers. And most of these guys are professional 2K players in the 2K League. Now, the scores of these games are no higher than 40 to 60 points. Everyone's just getting pluck, 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 pluck. Everyone is bumping the guards up. Lockdowns are destroying these guards. They are crumbled. The locks are having their way, and the guards cannot score the ball. So far, we have steals being too overpowered, unpluckable not being good enough, clearly, and we have delayed dribbling and shooting. Next, we have someone with finishing takeover trying to use the dunk meter, 
but it says bad shot selection when he tries to go for a dunk and the green window is so small i've seen people with 99 driving dunks not be able to time with the I'm putting my face back on here. I'm bad. The 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 green window is horrible. The dunk meter it is impossible to green. There is no point to use it. And it's saying bad shot selection. And this is all after the new patch. I don't think it used to be like this. But now look with sharp takeover and silver gold. Nah, it's 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 back and forth because I'm shooting decent every now and then. It, it's horrible. It's horrible. I don't know if it's because I ain't grinded down. I ain't got all my badges yet. That could be it. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm really here. Limitless. I don't know. But he is wide open with sharp takeover. And it is saying bad shot selection. Just because it's a few steps behind the three-point line now. 2K. The shooting was fine before this recent patch. Now it says bad shot selection with takeover. Wide open. What is the point of having sharp takeover? Next up, we have Flight and lots of other 2K players getting errors, lagging out of games, and then it counts as you quitting technically. It will give you this error code and say quitting games is considered bad sportsmanship. And then it will ban you for 30 minutes, one hour, or even longer. And you cannot play the game because 2K decided to give you an error code and make you lag out. Not even your fault, not your internet connection. It is all 2K's fault. And then you are not allowed to play the game anymore. I understand they added this feature to prevent people from quitting in games if people are playing with randoms so their teammates don't quit. But they need to implement something to where if you get an error, it does not ban you because that just doesn't make sense, man. So I'm not allowed to play the game for an hour plus because I lagged out of a game? That just doesn't make sense. And this is happening to Flight, one of the biggest streamers. So he is not able to play your game anymore and promote it. He's gonna have to go hop on something else, go react to someone else. This is only hurting you, 2K. I am just trying to help. Now, I wanna show you guys how Splash, the back to back 250K, my team champion, one of the best 2K players in the world, if not the best. I wanna show you guys how he feels about 2K24 so far and his opinions on the current state of the game. And I agree with absolutely everything that he says. Can't drive and don't you don't take off no more. I'm throwing the ball off his heads. They jump. You can't run around them because you bump into them and lose the ball. Like, how the f am I supposed to play this as a guard? How? What the f am I supposed to do? It just sound like I'm asking any guard. Ask any guard on the game. We can't do sh How the f are we getting patched and we already in the worst position on the game? We can't burst. We can't shoot. We can't. <laughs> oh god though that is the worst position in the game because like y'all can't even rebound but we, walk, we can't run we can't pass we can't dunk somehow we didn't still getting patched baluba in the in the cooking let's make them say bad shot selection nah we're not gonna give them jordan season one switch trey faith to ben mclemore make them find it nah we'll hide trey young behind season three as well Nah, don't let the center hit a layup neither. And then, then the PGs have to score. Oh God! Let's let him pluck him. Let's shrink the size of the court. I like that one. The court. I said the. I said it. Like, come on, my nigga. What the fuck am I playing, my nigga? This is ridiculous, bro. I've been trying to keep it a... I've been trying to keep it a whole foul with it, too. Like, I've been trying to do everything except call the game dog shit. The game is so ass. I can load up with the Lakers right now and hit 10 in a row with AD, but my AD can't hit a wide open shot off the wing. How AD able to hit yellow zone off, but I can't shoot wide open with sharp bats because it's a bad shot selection. That don't even make sense. I'm sure I go to the next and shoot with Ben Simmons. I hit one before my point guard. Lock shooting wide open in the corner, bad shot selection. How's the bad shot? He got 85 3. Send it wide open on the roll. Hit me earlier. Can't even catch it. Can't catch it. I thought I was playing Madden for a sec. I got a free form it. My center can't catch the roll. What the? Who, the, who my option? My shooting guard can't burst or shoot from Lindless. I can't dribble or shoot from Lindless. Only smiling on the court is the lock. Lock's just cheesing. Pluck. Let me pluck him. 
Bro, I got plugged by one. You might as well make five blocks and just go out and pro them and let's just all have 40 steals. Score at the end of the game. 16 to 14. 2K really has to buff unpluckable or something, bro. It's not even fair. There is no chance for guards to survive in this game against any lockdown. You don't have to be a good lockdown. You just have to be in front of the player. Tap your square button. You will get at least three minimum steals. Fanta said it. Splash said it. And these are the best players in the world. We go against the best competition, so we would know. All I'm saying is that something needs to be done. Either nerf steals, nerf the lockdowns, or just make unpluckable better. Make it so guards can actually move with the ball before getting plucked. Now, ghost contests were not a thing at the beginning of 2K24. As you can see, somehow that is a 38% contest. Now, he barely even contested him. Now, I'm going to show you guys multiple examples. This isn't even the worst one. As you can see, he is shooting directly over his head. He has a sharp takeover, he's a stretch, he has a very high jump shot. His hand is literally at his stomach, and he got there late. That should not be 38, maybe like a 15%. But look at this, guys. I run to the right past the screen, my center hits him, and that is a 34%. He jumped from behind me. The very next play, I get cooked, I contest him with my head for 30% from behind him. Look. He is behind me, no hand in my face, 34% contest. No hand in my face, he's on my side. Then I get a head contest from behind for 30%. I'm not even in front of him. They gave me a 30% contest for doing nothing. Shouldn't I be happy? They gave me a 30% contest for doing nothing. No, I don't want this. This is a bailout. He should have a wide open shot here. That should say wide open. In the NBA, if someone is behind you, their head is kind of close to your back no hand up in your face is that a 30 percent contest are you faced by that with a player behind you no that should say wide open they are not in front of me no hand up that should be a wide open jump shot the contests were not like this until patch 2 2k24 man they were not like this now moving on what is wrong with the barriers in this game 2k if you try to fade in the corner over half of the time, it will make you run out of bounds. As you can see, my player does one move and I try to fade in the right corner. And my feet are apparently too big that I step out of bounds. Now, this does not happen to me. This happens to Double H. Lots of guards that I play with. Everyone that I see try to fade in this corner or you do one dribble move and run that way. The barriers are so bad, it will make you accidentally step Why aren't we on two? I'm, I'm stopping this video. Everybody download 2K22. Add me. I'm going to drop my link, uh, my, my PS, PSN to my damn shit. Um, it's SureCap. Everything SureCap. At S-H-E-R-C-A-P. But I'm going to just put it in there since everybody want to act slow. If y'all trying to, you feel what I'm saying? If you're trying to hoop against me or if you're trying to hoop with me. Regardless, we on 22. It is different. It is different when this game gonna have to take like four months to even work, and then at that point the new game is getting and it the games come out too much. They need to just come out. And the next the don't come out with a twenty five, just come out with two K updated version.